everyone. China made another successful launch to their Tiagong space station today. Welcome to Reaching for the Moon. In April of 2021, China began construction of its three-module space station with the launch of the Tianhe core module. The Tianhe contains main living quarters for the Takamots. The Tianhe also contains docking ports for other modules to attach to it for and form the Tiagong Space Station. This past summer, China launched two laboratory modules, the Wenshin module and the Menshin module, which are both now, now attached to the Tianhe, and that created the first phase of the Tiagong Space Station. Both of these modules are designed to host scientific experiments. A Long March 2FY rocket carrying the Shenzhou-15 spacecraft with three taconauts on board, blasted off from the Zhuquian Satellite Launch Center in Northwest China on November 29th. Here's a short CGTN video of China announcing the success of the Shenzhou-15 launch. Nine, 八七六五四三二一点火 The trio of Takanauts will briefly stay in the Tiagong Space Station with the three Shenzhou-14 crew members that are already there. They've been on board for about six months and they're preparing to get back to Earth. The three Chinese Takanauts on board will carry out the Shenzhou-15 space mission experiments. The Shenzhou-15 spacecraft is composed of three modules. The first module is the orbital module, which is mainly used as a habitation space during the flight to the Tiagong space station. The Shenzhou spacecraft can also carry scientific instruments, payloads, and other cargo needed for the Tiagong space station. The second module is the reentry module. It's located in the middle of the Shenzhou spacecraft and it contains the heat shield that will be needed for reentry. This portion of the Shenzhou is the only module which the, will return to Earth when it brings home the Takanauts at the end of their mission at the Tiagong. Finally, at the end of the spacecraft is the service module. And the service module hosts the solar panels, the life support equipment, and propulsion devices used during the mission. The Shenzhou 15 mission is planned to stay in space until May of 2023, at which time Shenzhou 16 mission is planned to deliver three new Takanauts to the Tiagong Space Station. China intends to keep the Tiagong Space Station and have Takanauts on board for at least 10 years. China's next launch will probably be a new Tianzhou cargo launch which will occur in the spring of 2023. If you like today's video, hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button to receive an email every time Reaching for the Moon posts a new video. In the meantime, thank you for watching and remember always, failure is not an option. Bye.